Aloha from Hawaii, and I am on the Quantum of the Sea, and we're gonna tour the casino, Casino Royale here on the Quantum of the Sea. Let's get to it. Welcome to the Holy Roller, where it's all about playing craps and winning free cruises. I'm gonna show you what it's all about, so let's get rolling. All right, the Quantum class, and this is the Quantum. And so, yeah, just coming in, we'll see that. This one, this casino looks a lot like longer like instead of just a it's narrow and long like this a lot of a lot of i guess i should show you some of these just in case it's your it's your like favorite right um it looks like they have some dragon link and the firecrackers uh, i don't know about that i don't know about that log and link uh, different different locket links this one this one amber said this was her favorite right here so for those of you that are waiting for amber's slot video she said this is one of her favorites i think this is yeah it's like a low low volatility game and i don't know all of that but she does high volatility low volatility some of the screens are actually off like totally off here's a uh <laughs> Raking bacon. Okay, sorry, I don't want to move too fast. Um, but yeah, there, there's plenty of, plenty of slot machines. And let's see, we're gonna, we're gonna get to. Oh yeah, there it is. We see it. It's in our vision. It's a go that, go that way. Oh, no. oh man. Okay, I guess we're going this way. All right, there's some other stuff here. Some. Uh, some dragon five dragons oh man and then the i forget what this one this one is but i hate it other people like it <laughs> all right let's start with texas hold'em here um you can see that it has the bonus bet and that is why you always want to bet it that that 20 equals 20 you always want to bet that mainly because of this bet right here in fact I would put the same amount of money that I put here, I would put it there. Whatever the max is, I think it's $25 max on the bonus. I don't know. But yeah, that's something to think about. All right, let's check out this next table here. Another Texas Hold'em. Oh no, that one wasn't Texas Hold'em, that was Blackjack. This is Texas Hold'em. Here you go. You might have to pause it if you want to read it because I'm, I'm moving fast I'm moving fast three card poker three card poker here and there is that one this one's kind of hard to read all right there's the cashier cashier and there's the bar and uh Looks like some roulette over there. And another blackjack here. Same thing. $15 minimum on this one. I think the other one was 10. Here's here's a roulette. And I love it that they have these uh <laughs> I call them garbage disposals and <laughs> trap. But but the thing is they just put all the chips in there and all the chips are weighted. So they actually separate all the chips right in there and it's so much faster. You can get a lot of spins because if they don't have that, they're sitting there picking through it and you're just waiting for them to spin. And look, no scoops, no scoops, great will. All right, I love it. Um, I may be here, I may not, I may. And look at that, they even have one of these. Oh my goodness, some of the older ships don't have a don't have a board to see what rolled next or last I should say if you had a board that shows what rolled next you can make some money all right here's another one um oh this one's interesting so look this one they'd have to separate all the chips by hand so I would probably play at that table instead of this table because you'll get more spins more spins equals more points faster because you earn free points or you earn points to win a free cruise when you're playing and this this one regular average bet here this i heard uh somebody told me that if you play the bonus your average bet goes up way higher when you play that and so whenever you do play uh blackjack always go for the 
for the 20 equals 20 because it has some good payouts but that's where you get a lot of points all right another another one and this one does have the separators so that's good that's great all right and let's I'm gonna I'm end with the crafts table and then I'll, I'll show you the rest of this casino another three card poker same as the other over there so I don't I don't think that this if I had to guess the side with the cashier is always the non-smoking and then this would be the smoking side. Um, but you never know. Um, you never know. All right, here's another $10 blackjack. Same as before. And another blackjack. And it looks like they have a Texas Oldham uh, hosted game here. So important to know on this one here, you don't get uh, points for playing in the casino when you play on the hosted games or in the tournaments. So you won't get points towards a free cruise but you can win money off of other people that can pay for a cruise i guess <laughs> um so there's a 25 dollar minimum this one looks like brand new wow maybe it's because not a lot of people play the 25 dollars oh my gosh <laughs> all right here's another texas hold'em ultimate texas hold'em this one you do get points on when you play just don't get points on the other ones when you the screen is off and I oh oh okay whatever this is I don't even know this game oh my goodness now this this ship the quantum of the sea was originally um, made for the Asian market so this could be uh, a game that's popular in other parts of the world I don't know um, and the reason why is that you know that is a lot of the uh, the oh, ATMs, a lot of the um, a lot of the signage has multi language on it um, for the Asian market. So here, here's some looks like some video. No, no, I thought that was video poker. Oh, there they are. There they are. Ooh, they have Kino. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, Kino, everyone. Wow. Uh, I always check because people want to go to Kino, you know, off to Kino to unwind. Shout out, shout out to Casino Quest. All right, so uh, they do have Kino, Quantum of the Sea, market. They do have it. And uh, poker and blackjack. So. So on these ones, when it comes to points, every $10 gets you one point. On any other slot, every $5 gets you one point. And on the tables, it's all about average bet and time at the table, which gets you points. And I wanna say like $25 average bet for one hour is 25 points. I could be wrong, it could be higher, it could be lower, but I find that that is pretty close to what it is and so uh, hopefully you get more more than less all right here's the bar when you get to prime in the casino you get free drinks at the bar but that's one thing that's different about a casino on the ship versus casino on land if you're playing a game and you want a drink they're gonna charge it to your room just so you know it's still gonna be charged to your room oh buffalo <laughs> it's like a new version the buffalo which oh oh this right here this right here don't forget this is what you need to see right here because the casino host always want to check in with the casino host and you'll see we're on a 10 night cruise and so you see 800 points here how there's no booking bonus sometimes on a four night if you get 800 points you get 250 dollars off and you would get a booking bonus of a free cruise but not on a longer voyage. So that is four nights or less. Five nights to, I, I wanna say five nights to probably eight or nine. 1,200 points will get you a free cruise right here, but on a 10 night, 1,200 points is still only $300 off. The booking bonus on this 10 night 
starts at 1500 points that's where you get the interior and the booking bonus is not a interior it's a hundred dollars with a free play and you can see it just goes up interior interior 150 dollars then you get 3000 ocean view now this is crazy because i'm gonna show you something right right here real quick so this is the crazy part because look the hours of operation hours of operation because we're at the islands check it out it's closed first day second day third day fourth day it's closed so the casino is only open technically six days six days that you would have to get 1500 points now that's pretty easy but on a nut on a regular six day on a six six night i should say six night cruise 1200 points would be getting you a complimentary free cruise and here you only still have six days but you need 1500 to get that cruise wow wow all right so you're gonna want to make sure to check with the casino host and this is nice because they have a desk some some places they don't have a desk you can't find them you have to go to the cashier and ask for them and they'll be able to print out everything you need for that oh look the, more oh this one has I think it's probably the same thing but it definitely has Kino over here too all right so some of these games like it says off and and here is the coin pushers wow look at they have them all hanging off like like they're gonna you can actually get them look at that <laughs> I think you put in like a $20 worth of quarters and you might get a quarter out I think that's how it works something like that ah, that's my joke every time I do these call me bitter <laughs> call me bitter <laughs> all right so we're at the uh we're at the end this goes over there uh let me show you let me show you this up here there's the well this one they don't call it the royal promenade i call it the mall but guest services up there and stuff they don't call that the, the promenade i forget what it's called here uh, I put it right there. Whatever it's called, I'm putting it right there. <laughs> That's what it's called. All right. Um, so let's go over the crafts table and let's look and see what kind of crafts table we're we looking at here. So on the Royal Caribbean and uh, Royal Caribbean uh, ships, they don't have any bonus bets. I'll tell you that right now. So those that are looking for the all tall, small, and different things, um, they're not going to have that. They do have the hopping bets, but there's no bonus bets for crafts. And uh, you, this might look different to some people because usually you only see a C and E, which is the C is for craps, which is a 2, 3, 12, and the E is for 11. Um, and the horn, that stands for horn, which is craps and 11. So this is for each person wherever they're standing. So this person is standing here and there and there and there. And you can see that there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight spots. Usually there's just eight spots, even though this has like a little ninth one. There's really only eight spots. And wherever you're standing, good to know where your money is. So say if you're standing here, see these boxes around the number? One, two, three, four. That would be one, two, three, and four. So if your money's here, they're gonna place your money right there on the fourth spot. If your money is here in this rack, cause sometimes people stand right here and they'll have their money here, but they're standing here and nobody's right here. So they go a port up wherever your money is. So if your money's here, instead of being right here, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So that would be the fifth spot here, six, seven, and eight and i guess you'd probably have eight over here too but there, there's only do eight people per side so that's something to think about if you if you haven't known that before uh one thing that i thought was funny is somebody walked up uh, on my last cruise they walked up and and uh there was the hopping bets right here just like this but they didn't even know the difference they just thought that was bonus bets or whatever and they're like they threw out 15 dollars, and they're like give me five Give me five, 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 right? And they were like, they're like, okay, but, uh, and they're putting on the hopping beds and they're like, 
okay, but what, what, um, and they go five, five, five. And they go, okay, what, uh, $15, which one do you want high on? Five, 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 five. And they're like, five, 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 yes, five. Okay, but do you want the, the three, two, or you want the four, one to be $10 and $5 on the other? I'm like, what are you talking about? I want five, five, five. <laughs> and they're like, it's a it's a hopping bet. It's a one roll bet. And they go, oh, you don't have the, oh, okay, uh, just give it back to me. And then they rolled and it was a five. I was like, oh my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> that pays 15 to 1. I could not believe it. I, I should have probably hopped it after all that confusion was happening. Oh, my gosh. All right. So, um, two dice. <laughs> uh, they, sometimes it say both dice. But two dice must hit the back wall. So, this is on Royal Caribbean. If the dice don't hit the back wall, it's called a no roll. There's no warnings, no exceptions. And both dice have to hit the back wall, just so you know. So the stick person will call it and they'll just, sometimes they'll roll, they'll say, no roll. And, and it'll be like the point and everybody's like, ah, oh, man, why? And just, just know that going into it. I'm looking forward to uh, this. So they don't have the screen for right here for minimum. So I don't know what the minimum is. There's no screen. So I'm assuming that's $10 minimum. Um, but one thing that's very interesting on a Royal Caribbean ship is usually on on craps tables when you have a uh, $10 table your minimum bet you know on the line is $10 $10 $10 but um, on Royal Caribbean the minimum bet in the field they treat it like prop bets and it's a $1 minimum in the field unless you're not playing if you don't have any action if you're just walking up it's $5 minimum uh, $5 minimum, even if it's a $10 table, you'd have $5 that you have to put in the field. But say you have like a five, uh, $10 five, 12, six, 12 on eight, you could put $1 in here if you wanted to, which is kind of interesting. Sometimes they'll give me some change and stuff and I'll just put it there and I'll let it ride to see if it turns into a higher one. But yeah, just having $1 is crazy. Um, crazy awesome, I guess. All right. Well, Hey, I'm going to, uh, well, you've seen it. This is it. This is the casino. And so what I'm going to do is um, I'm going to go ahead and uh, I'm going to go ahead and actually stop this video and I'm going to do another video and I'm going to do some practice rolls here at the table uh, while the casino is closed. If you bring your dice, you can get some practice rolls in just to kind of see, is it is it a hard table? Is it a soft, bouncy table? Where where do you want to stand? Where do you want to shoot? How long is the table? This looks like about a 12 or 14 foot. And so, uh, no, it's probably 12, actually 12. And uh, so, and you can get in your favorite spot and do a couple throws. Hey, wanted to jump in and talk a little bit about the casino here on the Quantum of the Sea. And this one is a little bit different than the casino. I, I like it a lot, for one. There's no smoking in this whole casino. Okay, no. Yeah, it's a non-smoking casino. Which I haven't seen that before. Yeah, the whole Unless casino. It's a small other room. Yeah. Um, the dealers here are amazing. They're so much fun. I mean, we went to the crop table every night, and they've just been a riot. So good at what they do. I mean. Yeah, some ships the dealers are learning, and so it's kind of frustrating sometimes. But if you know that going into it, it's not that frustrating because you'll have some, patience. There are some that are still learning. Yeah, but there's but a good team. Great, but yeah. yeah. And I think one of the biggest things about the Quantum of the Sea uh, is the roulette. A roulette is the European roulette. So there's only a single zero. And if you're used to a double zero roulette wheel, all the numbers are in different spots. So, you know, you can't, like, if you usually do, like, uh, a quarter of the the pie, you know, or the wheel when you bet, all the numbers are all over the place. So you would want to study a, a European roulette wheel if you're going to be coming on the quantum of the sea. Well, hey, thanks for watching. Watch this video if you want to learn more, and we hope to see you cruising and rolling on a craps table soon. See ya!